damn. What just came off? <laughs> You're doing great. Hi guys, uh, the next video I have for you is going to be Como Olvidar, which is translated like how to forget and it's by Olga Tanyon and Jay Wheeler. Um, so Olga is an OG and you know what's funny? You know what's funny that I'm just realizing now that I'm saying her name? Olga Tanyon has always had like this high regard been like a high regarded artist for me growing up right like there's you just knew she was a very talented strong singer like her voice is like a, a punch to the face that's just what i'm saying like that's how strong of a vo vocalist that she is um and i never associated her name you know how like some people say ah, olga olga like no i never in my brain connected that olga to olga like i know you can maybe not even tell the difference to what i'm saying but now that i had to say her name and like see how it was written on the thing i'm like it was because i see it and i had to like mentally read it that all of a sudden i was like my brain is trying to say like hmm oh it's no and for me it's funny how those things had always been separate because that's how talented of an artist she was that despite this name that maybe when you say olga it just was different she made it into olga like tanyon like oh my god she's just a whew, she's a slayer and i hope that you can see that in this music video i hope that you're intrigued and let's get started Let's get started. Let's do it. There's something about her voice that you know, like the beat's about to drop, your your hips are about to start swinging. Like you just hear her voice, and you know that's where you're being led. <laughs> I gotta hear this again. <laughs> There's a lot of special effects in that rain scene, but it's like suspicious because it looks like the rain is definitely behind her. Um, so there's that. <laughs> Do you hear that? Like, she was just like throwing in the gauntlet. Like, it's about to go down. And do you see this hat that this woman is wearing? Do you see this outfit? Do you see this throne? she does not play okay like you guys want to talk about baddies Psst. this is a boss okay this is a boss <laughs> yes like oh my god just like how she just said that she's like how do i take this pain away from me it's just like Damn girl, you won't do it yourself. <laughs> okay, so then it just like slowed down. Ooh, I like that like different camera angle where it's um, like I don't know. You see like the gradient here. I like it. I like that she's being very playful in her music video, like doing different faces. She's having fun. The set design is really simple, but, you know, they're just, like, kind of having fun and, you know, I think the intention is to be more about the music than it is to be about the set. Or, for example, to tell a story through the set, because Olga has always... Olga Tanyon has always been a performative artist like her voice and her gestures are going to be grand so you know you can't exactly like expect her to like play a victim in some type of video or to you know it's funny how like another video I reacted to today that I don't know if it's going to come out before or after this but um, you know, it was more sad and it's funny how I tend to find more of that genre 
I don't know if it's because of 2020. I don't know if it's because of different languages. Um, what is popular. I, I do understand. And something I've appreciated in American culture. Like growing up in it. Is like the being authentic in your misery. Like it, Like misery is exposed. Which is kind of nice to just be like hey that's normal that's part of life the other side of the coin that i've always been a part of is that celebra uh celebratory part of life that like powerful part of life is the other side of the coin for me so it's interesting and i think they're both very necessary you know like you can't just live in one or the other but you gotta know that you have to go back to the other when you need to find strength and so i'm going on a tangent as usual but that how did i start this (laughs) but i hope you understand what i'm trying to say like you have to read your artist if you're going to make a music video you have to kind of know about what your artist is about how um what they're going to be projecting and the truth is it's like this is just one of those few cases where you've had an artist that has been around for a while and you don't need to really be selling a story because they're already an artist they've already put in a lot of work lyrically and for their career it's probably not have been about the the sets like it's been about the style it's been about the performing that live performance that almost feels like is b- no longer a thing at the moment but um we'll see we'll see for sure do you see the hips like yes it's like I had to. I had to. It's funny because like, like I've never had the chance to perform anything like super duper powerful or anything like that. But how much fun would it be to perform like these old timey like salsa classics where it is about like, like being that punch to the face. Like that's some bad like it's it's not like the modern bad energy it's like the old school bad energy where that it's like you are i don't even know like it's it's not bad it's not boss it's just like you're talented you're just talented you know sometimes it's like talented has been a little bit again part of the past i'm sorry to say i'm sorry to say i think talent's not necessary to be successful that's the truth you know it's about knowing people it's about being creative it's about creating an impression on people that really is something that leads to success as well but talent that that stuff is rare that stuff is cool to watch and to feel now we got the breakdown you see her face <laughs> she's like yeah the beat just did would this be considered the beat dropping yeah probably <laughs> <laughs> who oh my god who just did that who is this he's not mentioned but he's definitely like somebody that like calls her out and did you hear her sound? Like, she's always made this sound, too, in her performances. Hear it. Oh, my God. Very inspirational, just the way she is. I don't know how to explain it. Oh my gosh, guys, I miss dancing. <laughs> I need to dance more. I need to dance more. Literally, just like I can 
you can just feel it in the beat like the moments where you're just like apart and you're just feeling the beat and then you're like coming closer it's like oh my god it's so awesome <laughs> Build it down here at the end. Oh, she just her lashes. <laughs> that was like the best little like ending that I could have asked for. Like I was already really happy with them just walking towards. Like let's just watch them walk. It seems like a very fun shoot for sure. I'm gonna end it here with you guys real fast. I am not gonna adjust the thing. I enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you subscribe. I hope you like the Friday um, funsies on Mars. Let's go. Subscribe. Come join me. Thank you. Love you. Comment your stuff down below. Let's get involved. Let's do our thing. And I'm gonna go record another one for you. Thanks. Bye.